Nigeria came with the hype for round one. Supreme Promotions is doing all they can to make Sting 2012 an excellent experience for the patrons at home and abroad. For the folks who from Kingston, Mobe, Falmouth and Oche will be joining us at Jam World, you can travel and party like a rock star in style with Nutsford Express and their special Sting discounted rates. For info on that, be sure to contact Nutsford Express of course. But for those across the globe who won't be live on location, Supreme Promotions Limited and Downsound Records have partnered with Caribling Digital to bring the December 26th event on the internet. This is the sixth year that Sting will be streaming live by Caribling to audiences across the world. But this year, the production promises to have unique features and value-added components. Visit stingjamaica.com.jm to have your piece of the live experience. Next month's staging of Rebel Salute will see changes in the venue and format of the show, plus a family expo. According to conceptualizer Tony Rebel, the 20th staging of his annual Roots Bash will, for the first time, be over two days, January 18th and 19th at Richmond Estate in Priory St. Anne. The show will now be called Rebel Salute Health and Cultural Family Expo, taking place at a more central location that's a lot more spacious and provides more opportunities for persons who want to spend the night and enjoy the two days. Over 40 dancehall and reggae acts are scheduled to perform, and Tony Rebel believes that the two-day format will ensure that each artist gets ample stage time. The show's theme will be the preservation of reggae music and will feature Sisla Kalanji, Queen Africa, Luciano, Marcia Griffiths, Romain Vera and Tara Riley, plus others. And the other activities will include a health and cultural show, children's village and even cook-offs. With Spice and Macadam at odds in a slightly unexpected feud, dancehall industry players, artists and fans have been giving their comments and their views and their votes as to which dancehall diva they think will dominate in the Sting clash. But we spoke to Pompite and she gave Spice the upper hand. Here's her reason why. Well, actually, the clash between um, Spice and Maka would have more give Spice the winnings. I'm not telling like, a Spice more commanding. The lyrics them sound badder. And Spice is a clash artist. Spice come like a ninja man. At that bus, Spice clashing. Because Spice clash woolly per man artist. So we never seen a female do yet. I have to give her props. You know, she do the thing them, so I give her props. Yeah, man, I think Spice are the winner. Like, no. So MG was here at Hype, passed through our studios, and gave us a little bit of an inside scoop as to what he says you can expect at Sting. Check it out. Well, this is MG, you don't know, straight from Philadelphia, Jamaican Bert. And you don't know where they are, a PP or a selfish thing. And you don't know it's a full German thing. So you don't know we come for give your best. And you don't know it's only the best is good enough. So we here basically if you please the people and make everybody have a good time and get familiar with MG. Because MG is not really that a household name locally in Jamaica. It's mostly overseas. But so you don't know, never give thing it, it all and know so everyone can basically enjoy MG and enjoy MG music and get to familiar with MG. Because therefore, overseas is what's happening for me, not here. And you don't know Jamaica are the road. So for you can't please the road, trust me, it's a long way. It's waiting ahead of you. So you don't know, my day live in person for thing. Okay, Hype Peeps, I'm your girl Kim, and that's the Hype 4 on 1. Remember to keep safe this holiday. No drinking and driving, be careful on the roads, look out for pedestrians, and of course, try to be as nice as you possibly can. It's the season of giving. 